WWE 2K18 is just a couple months away. Time is ticking. It's coming sooner than we think. My name is Tango with Tango. You guys can follow me on Twitter at Tango with Tango. And today we got a lot of exciting news here on the Tony Pizza Guy YouTube channel. So I'm going to ask that you sit back, relax, and enjoy the video in its entirety. And as always, go ahead and give us a thumbs up on the video. And make sure you guys use the comment section. We're going to ask you guys a very important question in the comment section. So your participation is definitely appreciate it so let's talk about it wwe games has just announced that the roster reveal is coming to wwe 2k 18 fans all across the world it's happening tomorrow on ign which means you guys will be able to get all the information and news here on the tony pizza guy youtube channel now this is actually very exciting because it's very similar to the years before when wwe games would market out the game in segments or in installments so essentially little by little we keep learning more about the roster and it's very, very exciting because, well, WWE 2K18 is not that far away. Now, as you guys know, with WWE 2K18, we know a couple things and we're going to kind of review in this video. And we're going to talk about speculation as who as to who will be in the game and then who you guys want to be in the game. So make sure you guys leave a comment down below. Tell us who you want to see in WWE 2K18. Go ahead and smash that like button. Let's talk about it. We've already seen Randy Orton, Seth Rollins, Kurt Angle, RVD, Batista, uh, uh, John Cena, Brock Lesnar, Randy Orton, all these guys have been confirmed for WWE 2K18. We've actually seen their screenshot comparisons to 2K17. We saw the new screenshots, and WWE obviously announced with the collector's edition the new edition of RVD and Batista, which is very, very exciting news, but that means there are several more superstars to be revealed now if you guys saw the last video i did on this channel for the wwe 2k18 roster you know that i dropped some knowledge and i let you guys know that this will be the largest roster of wwe video games history and that's right we're getting close to 200 superstars maybe even 200 could be the lucky number but we're getting a huge amount of roster members in the game and being that there's so many playable characters one has to think who will be included in the first time for their first time ever in the video game, right? So if you think about it, NXT, you have Bobby Roode, who's never been in the game, Sanity, Authors of Pain, uh, you have Roddick Strong, you have Cian Almas, you have so many people that haven't been in a WWE video game. It's almost safe to say that at some capacity, some of these guys are going to be in the game so obviously the big question mark is bobby Roode. is he dlc does he come with a disc a lot of people have these question marks it's coming to their head they're talking about it on twitter they're tweeting us they want to know what we know and we don't know anything more than you guys do when it comes to the roster so drew mcintyre bobby Roode, what's going to happen are they going to be included obviously everybody's amped up for nxt but it doesn't just stop there. You have WWE 205 Live with the Cruiserweight division. And, of course, you have the WWE UK division, which is very exciting. We're going to talk about both and who should be in the game and how it's going to pan out for the future. Now, when you look at 205 Live, you have your new Cruiserweight champion, Tozawa, who's been featured on 205 Live and Raw uh, pretty pretty dominantly over these last few months. You have TJP, Rich Swan, of course, Brian Kendrick, and you cannot forget about Adrian Neville or just Neville these days. Uh, even though he's been part of WWE games before, the 205 Live addition to the game would be very huge. I think 205 Live should be saved for its own individual DLC pack, but obviously that's something that, you know, it's such a large roster, we don't even know what's going to happen with DLC and how DLC is going to be implemented into the game this year. But obviously, 205 Live, there's a lot of big names. And you can't forget about the names that I forgot. Grand Metalik, you have Tony Nice, uh, and you can't forget about the guy who's trying to save 205 Live, and that's Drew Gulak. By the way, he also wrote me a tweet on Twitter. He got a thumbs up from me because that was awesome. But uh, 205 Live has an awesome roster. Regardless of your personal opinions on the product, obviously these are the kind of guys that you want to play WWE 2K18 with. So in some capacity, hopefully we get to see them in the game. But then also people have question marks when it comes to WWE's UK division. It's fairly new. And a lot of these guys may or may not be on a exclusive contract with WWE. Of course, some of these guys are still appearing for other promotions, doing indie bookings. But we do see them from time to time on WWE's programming. So guys like Pete Dunne, who is the UK 
champion, Trent Seven. And of course, you can't forget about Mark Andrews. People want to know who is going to be featured from the WWE UK division. Now, the WWE UK division has been featured on and off on programming, but we haven't seen them step onto the main roster stage. So obviously, them being featured in WWE 2K18 is not... It's not impossible, but it's not probable unless they are DLC. Now, there was a rumor at some point that they were being scanned into the game. I'm not sure if that was ever confirmed or denied. But at the same time, too, the 205 Live roster is a lot larger than the UK roster. So if we do see anybody from the UK roster, I think we're going to just see very, very few. And that's not a bad thing, guys, because the UK roster, the 205 Live roster, and of course, NXT, it's all people that we have downloaded on 2k17's community creations so to have an official model with attire and music and move set it's going to be phenomenal it's going to be glorious just like bobby Roode would say so i want to know what you guys think in the comment section down below make sure you guys are subscribed here on the channel we're going to be bringing you guys the news right away once we get roster reveals in segments and installments we'll let you guys know and if any new gameplays or anything comes out with wwe 2k18 make sure you guys are subscribed because you guys are going to get that information right away and of course thank you for being a subscriber and thank you for being a viewer if you guys have any questions follow me on twitter at tango with tango thank you guys for watching